Hey guys, so I am back with another video and today I am going to be doing a hair tutorial which I have not done in a while. I'm actually going to be doing a twist out featuring some products from a company called Curl Temple. It's actually called Curly Temple. Um, I have three of their styling products that I'm going to be trying out today um, and I kind of wanted to show you guys from the beginning. Um, I have not used any of them but I'm going to go through um, and demo them for you and then I will be back at the end of the video to give you guys my review on the products. Um, <clears throat> the three products that I do have, I have the Kinky Tonic rose water and aloe vera juice curl refresher which I actually put this in the fridge you don't have to put it in the fridge um, but for day one I kind of want to use it how I would normally use my aloe vera juice so that's why I put it in the fridge and I keep my aloe vera juice in the fridge and spray it on my hair cold so that's why I put it in the fridge but then in between wash days like if I want to use it as a refresher I'll leave it out of the fridge but um, I did put it in the fridge so it is cold so that's the first product that I'm going to be using and then the next product I'm going to be using the Island Frizz the Citrus Frizz Fighter, uh, Fighter. Um, it's kind of like a detangling curl enhancing kind of leave-in kind of product so I'm going to be using this as my leave-in <clears throat> um, I will I don't know if I'm going to apply it do like the lock method because the next product it does say um, it's like an oil cream. Um, this is the Curl Lada. This is the Mango Butter and Moringa Oil Heavy Cream. So I don't think I'm going to use an oil in between the leave-in and this because I do usually do the lock method. But I think I'm just going to try it out with just those two products. Um, so that's what I'm going to be using as I'm styling my hair. Um, as I'm going through the demo, I will give you my thoughts. I will do a voiceover on my thoughts of the products as I'm using it. Um, but I'm going to jump right into this. I'm trying not to make this long. This is their um, Juicy Twist Out um, bundle. So these three products come in the bundle. So I am going to be doing a twist out just to see, you know, if it, you know, does give me a juicy twist out nonetheless. Um, I haven't done a twist out in a while. I've been really into my wash and goes. But um, I wanted to just switch it up for a minute because I know all summer I will be doing like my wash and go series. But I wanted to try a twist out for now and see how that works. And yeah, so we're just going to jump into it. And like I said, throughout the video as I'm using each product, I will give you my thoughts on the product as I'm going through. So if you guys want to see if I get a juicy twist out after this, then keep on watching. Okay, so I'm starting off with freshly washed and deep conditioned hair. Um, and I'm just going to be working in these four sections and doing my twist based off of that. First, I'm going to go in with the Kinky Tonic and I'm just going to spritz that on my hair. Like I said in the intro, this is cold when I applied it. Um, so just give you a heads up that it is cold. Next, I'm going to go in with the Island Frizz Curl Frizz fighter and I'm going to apply that to my hair as my leave-in. I'm just going to rake that through and then I'm going to go in with my, I believe my Felicia Leatherwood uh, detangling brush um, just to detangle that section. My hair is really, really detangled and um, both of these products um, definitely aided in detangling my hair so that's always a plus. Next I'm going to go in with my styler. This is the Curl La Da heavy oil cream um, and I'm just going to be applying that to each section and I'm just going to twist my hair and I don't really need to explain how to twist guys because you should know how to do that um, but that is the order that I'm going to be applying the products throughout this entire process so as I'm twisting my hair I just want to talk about the um, kinky tonic and the island frizz First, the um, Kinky Tonic, I actually really, really, really like. Um, it was actually really cool to actually try out rose water and aloe vera juice together. Um, I actually really liked it. I do keep it in the refrigerator and use it cold. That's just my preference, um, and I like it that way. I haven't really, I used it to refresh my hair, but it was cold as well. But you don't have to. That's just, you know, my preference, but I really, really like that. The Island Frizz, I really, really like. I do get into more detail about it at the end of the video, but I actually really, really like it as well. It doesn't have like a lot of like white residue, and I do think it's very moisturizing. It definitely helps with detangling and defining my curls. So I would definitely want to try this with the wash and go, but I do talk about this a little bit in a few minutes. 
Okay, so I've finished applying all of the product. Um, I kind of used my t-shirt just to get rid of any excess and just kind of squeeze it out because I didn't want it, my hair to be too way down and or whatever. I, I wasn't sure how much product I was using, probably using too much, too little. But I did wipe off any excess that I did see. My twists do look very juicy. I don't know if you guys can see that. Turn um, I think they look really juicy so that's a good thing uh, um, but nonetheless I like how my hair smells I like how it feels um, I'm probably gonna sit under my hooded dryer for about 20 minutes just to soak up any excess water and then I'll let my hair air dry the rest of the way but I do want to sit under the hooded dryer for about 20 30 minutes so far I do like it I like the island frizz I feel like this would be a really good um, leave-in to use under like a wash and go um, because it's not really light and it, it's I don't know you know when you kind of mix products together and it doesn't give like that really harsh white residue this is kind of like that I feel like this will be really good under a wash and go as well so you might see that in the future but I'll get into my rest of the, my final thoughts of the products once I do the takedown and I will see you guys in a little while okay so this is the next day guys and my hair was completely dry i did apply a little bit of oil on my hands just to kind of help with any frizz and i'm going to take all of these twists down very very carefully because i don't want it to be too too frizzy at least not on the first day um but i want to now talk about the pearl lada um i really 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 like this cream my hair was so Soft. like I wish you guys could feel it it was so it was pillow soft after using all of these products um, together I really really liked how the twist came out they were really defined really soft um, kind of how I would like my twist outs to look you know I'm not really like a overly defined twist out type of person but these just gave the right amount of fluff the right amount of moisture the right amount of just softness so I actually really really enjoy all these products a whole lot um, definitely check it out I do have a coupon code down below for you guys to check it out if you are interested and definitely um, let me know if you've tried any of their products before and how they worked on your hair down in the description box but that is it for the video guys I really hope you guys enjoy and I will see you guys next time bye